Hi everyone, welcome to this uh, two-day Python and Django workshop. So I am uh, Vinita. I am uh, working as a project manager in FOSI. Ankit and Prathamesh uh, are our Python team members. They are uh, well-experienced Python people and they work as a software developer and engineer in our uh, project. So they'll be guiding you throughout the workshop. So firstly, FOSI works for open source software. We promote and develop a various open source software. And uh, Professor Kannan Modgalya is the PI of the FOSI project. And Professor Prabhu Ramchandra is closely looking for the uh, Python uh, project in FOSI. So uh, today we will actually have a Python workshop where you will initially, as per the schedule, I think uh, you will start watching Prabhu sir's uh, video, but uh, we'll be always there. If you have any uh, doubt regarding these, you can just ping us on the chat or uh, tell us that you have a doubt, then uh, anyone can unmute you. So we'll be always there. And there'll be some live sessions, which uh, Ankit and Pratmesh will always uh, take. So I hope everyone is uh, ready and uh, you have installed everything on your system before we start. Okay, so all the best. And if you have any issues, uh, please let us know. And uh, we are always available on chat. If you have anything, you can always unmute and uh, start. Okay, so thank you and uh, all the best. Ankit, you can start. Thank you. Hello, everyone. Ms. Vinita said, welcome to the session. Uh, I see that a few folks are still joining in. So we'll give it five minutes maybe. Uh, but in the meantime, I just wanted to make sure that everybody received the guidelines for today and tomorrow's workshop via email. So you have the Zoom link in the guidelines. You have the installation instructions to install Anaconda, uh, which is the Python environment. You have the schedule and you have the uh, details and the instructions on where to join and where to sign up to be able to follow along the video courses. So we have a YAPS portal, which is our in-house learning uh, management system and uh, you are supposed to be able to access the YAPS portal and create an account and then be able to access the particular courses which contain the videos for today and tomorrow. Uh, so I just wanted to make sure that everybody firstly has Python and Anaconda installed. Uh, please uh, uh, please let me know if you had any issues. In case you have any issues, we can try to sort of uh, help you out with the installation issues if possible. Uh, you can still take some time out and try to reinstall in case you're still facing problems. Uh, apart from that, so please give me a yes in the chat if you already have Python and Anaconda installed. So I see that uh, quite a few folks have already said yes to the Python installation. Cool. Uh, the next step is uh, registering on Yaksh. So please uh, visit yaksh.fossi.in and please uh, search for the course with, uh, I'll, I'll, I'll drop in the instructions here, one second. Okay. So a few folks are already enrolled. Uh, for those of you who are not enrolled, uh, here are the instructions. I'm pasting them in the chat. Uh, please make a note of the instructions. Uh, in case you're not enrolled, uh, please make sure that you do. The course that I've put in the chat is the course for day one. Uh, I do not see any enrollments for that particular course at this point in time. So please make sure that you are enrolled. Uh, in that particular course, please go through the instructions once again and make sure that you are enrolled. I'm pushing the instructions once again. 
Even I have participated in that Yaksh portal, but this course is not visible. Uh, there is a uh, preliminary course is there, but uh, can you can you search again, please? Uh, this was created very recently. It is possible that you may have missed it yesterday, but uh, it should be visible today, right now. Uh, please type in the correct course code. Make sure that you have typed in the correct course code with uh, the letters, no spaces, no caps. Uh, please, please scroll to the bottom. So in case you've already participated once or twice before, uh, it is possible that things will show up a little on the bottom. Please scroll to the bottom and make sure that you're enrolling in the right course, which is uh, FOSSI two-day Python and Django course, day one, November 2022. So please make sure that you're enrolled. Uh, the preliminary course uh, was supposed to be completed before you joined the course. Uh, so please uh, make sure that you have completed the preliminary course before you're joining here because it contains essential Python basics that are necessary. Uh, if you're enrolled, you're enrolled. If you're enrolled, you get a very clear enrolled button that shows up on the side. Uh, for folks who can't find the course, please make sure that you type. So if you go to Yaksh, if you log in, you'll find a search bar on the top. The search bar on the top is the place where you have to type in the course code. What is the course code? The course code is Django NOV Prelim, right? And once you type that, uh, you should be able to uh, see the course. There is one course that is seen in the Yaksh portal that is P triple M. So you enrolled for it, right? I enrolled for it and I started, but you said no enrollment seen. So in the very beginning, I couldn't see, but right now, oh, yes. I, I guess that folks have started enrolling, so it should show. Thank you. Uh, okay, so for folks who already enrolled and have already begun the course, Please make sure that you are following the schedule. The schedule is also available in the notification email that you receive. Uh, if you see the schedule gives you the title of the module that you're supposed to complete. So it will tell you that this is the recorded module on YUX. Any recorded module is available on YUX. Anything that happens live will happen in this Zoom session, which will be conducted by either me or my colleague Prashamesh. So we will have some recorded sessions today and some of them tomorrow. Anything that is recorded or is a video will happen on Yaksh. It will be pre-recorded. You're supposed to view it. You're supposed to go through the content. Make sure that you follow along the content. Practice it on your terminal and follow along with all the, all the exercises that are happening within the video. Then there will also be sessions. So for example, today there'll be a session at two o'clock after lunch, which will be live where we will be setting up Django and setting up the environment for Django. That is one. Uh, so again, very simple. Anything that is recorded happens on Yaksh. Anything that is live uh, in the schedule, anything that is labeled live in the schedule is happening in this Zoom session, right? Uh, we also have Q&A sessions. Uh, the Q&A sessions um, are basically uh, sessions where you can come uh, revisit the Zoom session and ask any questions here. We'll be available all through, so uh, not necessary that you need to have the Q&A session to ask a question. You can just drop your question in the in the chat, and uh, we'll sort of try to answer it as 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 to the best of our capabilities. Uh, and uh, that's about it. So uh, basically, follow along all the videos that are mentioned in the schedule. The, the, the name of the module is given in the schedule. And suggested timelines are also given. So you're supposed to follow along. Uh, try to complete it in the, in the given time slot so that you are able to cover the uh, videos and the content that is necessary to follow along with the next module. There will be Q&A sessions, which will usually be for 10 to 15 minutes. You can come in the Zoom session. The Q&A sessions will happen in the Zoom. You can come here, ask your questions, and we'll try to answer them. You can unmute yourself and ask them if you want to, and we can try to answer them for you. 
and then there will be proper live sessions that will happen for django setup and django training which will happen today and tomorrow and they will also happen in zoom uh, so you will have to be here on the time slots mentioned in the schedule so for example the first live session today happens at 2 pm to 2:45 pm and you will have to be available here so that you can attend the live session the recorded sessions in yak should be kept available for you uh, even after the workshop is over the live sessions though will not be something that we can repeat for you every time they will be recorded and circulated later on but they will be happening live so you will have to be available here to be able to attend those right missing out on any portion will mean that you will not be able to follow along things afterwards that's about it so the session for today lasts from uh, about now that is 9:15 to 5:30 in the evening uh please try to follow along please try to complete the videos in case the videos don't complete in time you can sort of complete them after the day gets over or after the live sessions are done but please make sure that you are available for the live session uh excuse me uh, see i have uh, installed django i mean i have installed uh, this a uh, python and i'm get, i'm i'm logging into the yaksh portal and i'm getting this uh, the first page that i get you know with all saving scripts and all those are there in the plotting list and numpires and all Correct. that so so after that do i have is that the starting of that or no, is there so if, if you have a look at the uh, schedule yeah. uh, the the specific modules that you need to start with are given there so for today you will have to start with basic data types and then control flow uh if you scroll okay. down they should be available uh, uh basically some modules are a part of the prelim they are an overlap with the preliminary course oh, but okay, okay. you just kept them available so that you can refer to them later uh if you scroll down you only have to do the necessary modules that are given in the schedule you don't have to follow all the modules okay 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 yeah yeah so thanks thanks for anyone who is curious there will also be quizzes in the course uh you can attempt those quizzes uh we do not uh, there's no hard consideration of the course of the quiz so uh, you do not have to worry uh, there are only a single attempt quiz but we do not take all the course into into consideration to a certain extent uh, please uh, they are they are put there for a reason though uh, that is you need to sort of review what you learned in the past session which is why they are there Uh, so please give them honestly and sort of make sure that you are getting something out of this, which is why the quizzes are in put in place. Okay, so for folks who already enrolled uh, in the course, they can please go and start with the basic data types module. I see that a few folks are sort of complaining that they are not able to register or enroll. I will try to help them out with uh, what is going wrong. Right, so. uh i can see that dr t varaprasad rao and shelly siju george are facing some issues uh shelly and dr rao can you please make sure that you have typed in the correct course code in the search bar you are not supposed to type in the name of the course you type supposed to type in the course code the course code is django nov prelim once you type in that course code uh, you will get maybe possibly a few courses please scroll to the bottom and try to see if you can find the course with a particular name which is fossi 2 day python and django course day 1 uh, for folks who asking if they can leave the zoom session now yes you can leave the zoom session now and join back after you're done with your uh, uh, video lesson mm -hmm. So I'm sorry, but still I didn't get the course. Uh, can I share my screen or how to sort of? Ah uh, yes, you can. You can share your screen. Okay. So this is the portal. Correct. Uh, so you have an enter course code to search, right? So you already yeah. typed that, is it? Right. This is this one. So in that case, uh, the preliminary one was supposed to be done before you joined the course. It's supposed uh, to enroll. That you have done. You are uh. supposed to enroll for Fossi two day Python and Django course day one. Okay, so here what should I type? Okay, this. You're one. already okay. there. The second one, click on enroll. 
no the second one this is this day one. one yes day one okay 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 sir it came it was not appearing okay sir so i should see the video from here now okay. yes you can click on start uh, you will see a lot of modules but please only select like go to the specific module that you've typed out in the uh, schedule which is basic okay. data types okay, uh, okay but sir. there are a lot more after that so please follow the schedule okay okay sir thank you i will stop sharing for folks who would like to stay in the meeting you can you can stay in the meeting if you are okay with it but if you want to leave the zoom meeting to to sort of go and look at uh, the videos and do that as well um, accessibility when you should join back sir so according to the schedule we have a q and a session at 11:40 so if you have any specific questions uh, at that point of time you, you can okay. join back uh, but there are also video lessons after that So 11:40 to 11:50 is the Q&A session where we will be available to solve your questions. So we'll be in the Zoom session, and at okay. 2 p.m. we'll have a live Django session. So we okay. need you at 2 p.m. at any cost. Okay. So one more question: As we are leaving the Zoom meeting now, the attendance will not be given, right? That link will not the, be shared. Sorry. So the, the the attendance will always be given only in the Zoom chat here. So if you need to keep track of that, you may have to like, keep a Zoom session window open and mute it if okay. you don't want okay. to. Okay. 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 So we are telling you uh, to. We are not telling you to leave the Zoom, but uh, uh, if you are watching the videos, uh, just keep the audio of the Zoom off so that it doesn't disturb you. We are always there here on Zoom, so whatever it is, you can ask us, and uh, we will keep. I think uh, around eleven, we will post uh, the ten thirty eleven. We'll post the link for the attendance. okay so just get started and uh, just uh, you can audio mute the audio of this uh, zoom and start watching your uh, tutorials yeah i can unmute uh so professor rao Were you able to find the course? Uh, please reply in the chat in case you were or you were not able to. Thank you. Cool. I can see your screen. Uh, right. Can you go to just yaksharpossi.in for now? Hi, Shelly. Uh, can you please remove the portion of the URL and just go to yaksharpossi.in? Yes, I can see your screen. Shelly, but I need you to go to the home page of the website, which is yaks. dot fossi. dot in. That's it. So, uh, what you can do is you can type out. and django nov prelim in the search bar on the top that you can see uh, you can even copy paste what i've just typed out if you don't want to so once you've done that i can see that you have a few courses here so you have to join the second course which is the day 1 november 2022 you can click on enroll once you click on enroll uh, it should get you enrolled and you can click on what is that continue no start and you should be able to uh, view all the modules you only supposed to follow along the modules that are given in the schedule the first module is basic data types please scroll down to uh, click on details to see specific modules there will be specific modules inside it and there will be something called basic data types so just scroll down uh, these ones are the initial ones which were already there in the preliminary Please scroll down. You can stop sharing now. Uh, basically, I guess I fixed the issue for you. You should be able to find your own uh, modules at uh, Nidhi. Uh, if you if you wish, you can share your screen. If not, you can tell me exactly what is going wrong. Maybe you've already logged in. Uh, maybe there was some similar issue like Shelly, where you could search for the course but you were not able to see it. Uh, so please. Search for the course using the course code Django Nov Prelim. 
please look for the specific course that we've given and then click on enroll clicking on any of the other courses older courses etc could give you weird errors thank you hello sir can we leave the meeting now uh, i do not mind though your attendance and other administrative tasks will happen in the zoom chat if you leave the zoom chat now maybe you will not get the history of the zoom chat later uh which could be a problem because then you will not find the link to the attendance so what you could do is you could keep the tab i don't know if you're using a browser zoom inside the browser you can keep it on mute the tab on mute if not you can just mute your zoom session if that's possible um hello sir can we record this uh, workshop so what happens is uh, the sessions that are pre recorded on yaks are already available uh this session is also recorded uh if you can see there's already the zoom session is being recorded so this will be circulated after the workshop is done so you do not need to do it separately if you do not want to or uh, perfectly up to you again back to miss nidhi trivedi if you still face issues please let me know and you can share your screen and i can help you out if not uh if you think you can figure it out on your own no problem uh to folks who already installed python please make sure that python is working fine uh please make sure that python is working okay for you a lot of you folks use windows so uh, we know historically that it can be a bit troublesome to start and run python on windows so in case you need any help please let us know uh pooja vaidya says that it could be a, there could be data consumption issues if zoom is open uh i unfortunately cannot help you there uh i just had to say that uh the the attendance link do get circulated on zoom if if you think that you can visit the zoom session again and can capture the uh, chat history then it's fine ankit so uh what we can do is when they come back to for q and a that time we can circulate that that event. works fine yes so what we can do is okay so yeah we can do that uh, what we can do is we will circulate the uh, attendance at 11:40 right uh, and it will be it will be circulated from 11:40 to 11:50 anything after that and we can't help you right very simple so folks if you want to if you think that there's a data consumption issue and and sort of data network issues you can leave and we can guarantee that the attendance link will be circulated at 11:40 exact and you should be here at that time and when when it is being circulated i guess that solves the problem for a lot of folks thank you anyone having issues with python you can please let me know in chat uh a few folks were asking if you can use vs code etc uh so i do not mind any person using any sort of editor or a development environment but it is good if you follow along exactly what we need as an installed environment as suggested in instructions because that is what we will follow in all the subsequent sessions from now on uh, if you can figure your way out with just vs code and python that's fine uh the recorded sessions again etc use a few pre installed modules so anaconda is a better option you can use vs code you can use jupyter notebook as long as you think you can figure things out that's fine jupyter notebook is a web based environment uh that will not work for django sessions so so please make sure that you have something more solid that works for the django sessions Anaconda installed on your computer is the best way forward. Uh, if you have that, you're set for life. Uh, if you're having issues with installing Anaconda, we can try to help you out. Uh, if you're using anything that is not recommended, you're on your own. Uh, we could try to help you, but we cannot guarantee that we can help you because it will be too different from what we are trying to guide you with. Sir, so nothing is audible. So, if, if you are not here for the past few minutes, uh, please make sure that you have the schedule with you. The schedule was sent to you via email. If you have a look at the schedule, there are some sessions that 
say that they are recorded sessions on yaksh those are the sessions that you need to visit yaksh.fossi.in enroll in the course and then view the course and the module that is specified in the schedule please try to follow the timeline so that you are on track there are then there are some sessions that are q and a session where you have to be available in zoom to be able to ask any questions and we can solve those questions for you and then there are the second type is the live session which are mostly django live session which will today will happen at 2 to 2:45 so you should be available only in zoom at that point of time where i and my colleague prathamesh will take those live sessions for you so the, at the moment according to the schedule you are supposed to be on the yaks platform enrolling for the course and then starting with the basic data types module if you not yet enrolled on the on the yaks uh, yaks platform here are the instructions in the chat again and once you enroll you should be able to see the course and once you are able to see the course you should be able to see the right module which is basic data types and then follow along with the video in that session uh, i'll not be speaking here so the zoom session will be pretty much inactive uh, when you folks are watching videos on yaks because this is a hybrid sort of workshop but we will be live here to solve any issues that you are having so we will be available in the zoom session if you are having any issues so please just drop a message in the chat if you are having any issues and we'll solve them for you apart from that we will be here for the q and a sessions and the live sessions at the right point of time for the right time slot please view the schedule that you received in your email cool so some folks have mentioned that they have not received the schedule here is the link to the schedule in the chat 